Hi there. Hi. What, what's your name? Sorry, Hi, mate. my name is Mike Miles. Hi. And I'm from the uh, private sector. And uh, we are, uh, first of all, I have to say, I'm very impressed with this conference setup. And that's not because I'm on camera. I have, I've tired of conferences. I don't go to them anymore. Uh, the setup of this conference is absolutely bang on. And for a cynic like me to say that, that's, that's something. But effectively, we're private sector. Uh, and we're taking a radical approach to this. We're going to partner with the social sector. Um, with our specialist area is in high growth innovation. So uh, the vision that we're looking for is the world's next iPhone or the world's next Dyson will be effectively a social enterprise. Uh, and all the profits will go into the various communities in the various parts of the world. And the investors will receive a sales-based royalty. Sounds uh, great. It's great, it's fantastic. We actually, we actually think it's the, the most realistic form of social capitalism because uh, there's a quid pro quo. Getting a hot new idea to the global marketplace these days is extremely tough. So all the innovators face a major challenge. If you partner with effectively the consumer by partnering with this community, you've got a really good friend. So, so what will your organization's role be then? We are at the moment are innovators. We are, I'm an innovator entrepreneur. Um, so we've got a, I've got a team of like Dragon's Den type investors behind me. And I've convinced them that the best way to take the next high growth, these high growth innovations which we've developed forward is uh, through the social uh, uh, enterprise route, but by putting in top management that understand the world of global business, uh, which is why I'm talking to Duncan. Uh, and uh, I would say that basically watch this space because our first earth changing uh, innovation will be hitting the markets around about January, February of next year with this model. And our first trade sales start next week uh, on one of our less um, uh, intellectual property sensitive products uh, being sold and marketed in schools and colleges, uh, which we're involving the pupils and the students in the real businesses real time. So they're part of hopefully changing their world for the future and they'll become employees. Uh, and quite frankly, at the moment, they're ahead of us. I'm having to slow them down. Sounds great. Um, what have you enjoyed about the morning then? You said you were, you were enjoying the conference um, unusually. What, what, is it the speakers you've enjoyed here from Duncan or anything in particular? I have enjoyed the real the way this, the conference has been structured. There's been enough time to, to talk. There haven't been a bunch of egos just downloading stuff for two or three hours at us. Uh, and I, act, I must say, I'm astonished that the speakers you've got, Liam Black uh, is, and, and Duncan, these are guys, guys that uh, you don't get to meet. Uh, so I know who organized that and how he pulled it off, but uh, congratulations on that. But also the people here. Uh, this, I met about four or five people I hadn't met before and reconnected so it's actually been 10 times more productive than if I'd been nose to the grindstone for the last two days. I wasn't coming back today. I was only coming yesterday. Uh, and I've, I've cancelled meetings to come back here. And I am so glad I did. Well, we're so glad to hear that. Thank you very no much problem. for joining us. Thanks. Bye.